Hey guys and welcome to this video on the Python programming language. So in this video I want to create a Python program that does sentiment analysis. And sentiment analysis is basically the process of computationally identifying and categorizing opinions expressed in a piece of text, especially in order to determine whether the writer's attitude towards a particular subject, topic, or product is positive, neutral, or negative. So let's go ahead and get started. First thing you're going to need to do is install a text blob. So you can do that by saying pip install text blob. Now I already have it installed on my computer here so I don't need to reinstall it again. Next up what we're going to do is we're going to import text blob. Alright and we're going to do that by saying from text blob import text blob. Now we're going to create the text that we want to analyze. So I'm going to create a variable called text. And inside uh, these quotations here, the text will, will read Python is a very good language to learn. And now we're going to create our uh, object. So I'm going to call it obj, short for object. So that's going to be our variable. And I'm going to set it equal to text blob. And text blob is going to take in the text variable that we just now created. Now what we want to do is find out what the sentiment is. So I'm going to create a variable called sentiment and set it equal to the object uh, variable that we just created and we're going to get the object dot sentiment dot polarity and this here will return a value between negative 1 and 1 to determine the sentiment of the text. So let me go ahead and write that here in, um, in some comments here. So we're going to say this returns the sentiment of text by returning a value between negative 1 and 1. Okay, so a, a negative value means that we have a negative uh, attitude towards the text or the text has a negative attitude towards whatever topic uh, the text is talking about and uh, a positive value so a value that's greater than zero would show that the text or the author of the text um, has a positive attitude towards the topic or subject and then a value of zero means that the author's uh, attitude towards the subject is neutral all right so that should be it. Let's now print sentiment. Okay, and let's save this. So I'm just going to go to file and save. And let's go to our command prompt and type in the keyword Python and then go to the location where we've saved the file. So I saved it on my desktop. So users, um, let me see, desktop. Yep. And then the name of the program, which is sentiment.py. And let's run it. And let's see what value we get back. So we get back a nice value here. It says 0 0.9099999. Well, I'm not going to uh, count off all those nines, but that's pretty positive. It's almost one. So we can safely say that the, um, the author, which is myself, uh, attitude towards this particular subject is positive. And yes, we could have guessed that from the text that says Python is a very good language to learn. However, if we had much, much more text to, uh, to analyze, maybe it wouldn't be so obvious for us. But here we have a very easy tool to come up with the analysis for us. So thank you guys for watching. Please leave any questions you have in the comment section. Don't forget to hit that like button. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. And if you found the video helpful, please share it. I will be sure to put the code, uh, a link to the code on my GitHub below in the comments. And as always, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.